Hello and welcome! I'm Mitz Piano and you're watching Paper Mario, The Door of the Great Train. Because that's going to be our goal today. Like, we found that the x knots had installed a door on the tree for no real reason, and we need to go find someone named Flurry. So what are we waiting for? Hey, you got any more stuff for me? Yeah, I'll take a fire flower. I mean, I've seen them for cheaper, but I don't particularly care. I like fire flowers. I'll take one of these, too. If we encounter more of those high defense guys, then... yeah. We're set for the future. Anyway... Hmm... wonder how I get back there. Maybe I need, like, wind powers from this... Really? The... Oh, we have something new here? Okay, well, hold the heck up. And think we'd run into new enemies, but that's a dark puff. It's basically a tiny, mean thunderhead. Max HP is three, attack is two, and defense is zero. Sometimes it'll charge itself with electricity. Don't touch it when it does. Youch! You know what I mean, right? Psst. Shocking! After it charges itself, it'll totally zap you with lightning. Beat it as fast as you can. Well, glad we have this information. I... We got shrunk. Oh, what the heck. Alright. Um, hopefully this doesn't affect pow block power. Get powed. Oh, get squished. Yeah, that's what you get for shrinking me. Boy, I lucked out there, didn't I? I didn't think I'd use that so soon. Anyway, oh, here's another thundercloud. Two of them. The cube! This is... Release spell. Attack plus three. Whoa! Okay, that's really cool. See, I missed the command and I still win anyway. Yep. Oh wait, no! That guy was gonna throw a flower at me! Ah, I could've used that. Whatever. Get bonked. I'm totally going for flowers next level up, because... Um... Yeah? Hello? Oh! Okay. Did not expect to have to do this, but... Bop. How does making it higher help? Oh, it helps because there's a pipe there, and I somehow missed that. First off, we need this mysterious, powerful object. Collecting it will help. Then, we can pay for playing over there. Hmm. Not quite. Alright. Too low again. Need to stop going through dives. Hmm. 
There. Alright, give me whatever this is. Quake hammer. Damage all enemies on the ground or ceiling. Ooh, that's useful. I'll take it. I'll take it over power bounce because I keep messing up power bounce. Okay, more storm clouds. Get bop. Give me some of that syrup so I can try out the quake hammer next turn. Or right now. Get smash. Alright, so let's see. Does shell bashing into this guy count as touching it? No. Cool. We are learning things today. Must be Flurry's house. Because, yeah, we saw that earlier. And we'll take your overpriced heal. Because I am that desperate for flowers. Anyway, hey, Flurry, you home? Excuse me. Um, maybe she isn't here. I wonder if she went for a walk in the woods. Maybe. Time check! It has only been about eight minutes. We're fine. But I'll still hit this save point anyway. Just as soon as I make sure I'm still recording. Pretty nice place for, like, an abandoned house in the woods. <laughs> Madame Flurry, hello! If you're here, say something! <gasps> it's locked. Eek! <laughs> no! Out of the question! You mustn't come in here! <laughs> uh, Madame Flurry, are you there? Is that you? What are you doing? Oh, wait a moment, those darling, squishy little footsteps. Is that you, Punio? Oh, it's been an age since I saw you last, poor dear. Is there something you need? Uh, well, the thing is, we have a problem. The Great Tree's entry hole is blocked. My puny friends are trapped inside, so they're in a pickle, and Mario needs these crystal stars. It's a train wreck, really. That's why we need you to come with us and find the secret entrance, Madame Flurry. Oh, is that all, dearie? You came all the way here just for that? My adorable little punio, you know I would do anything in my power to help you. Somehow I don't think it's going to be that simple. However, lamentably, I'm in a bit of a bind myself. I just cannot come out. Closeted for life. Gee, is something wrong? It's somewhat embarrassing, but I never go out without my favorite necklace. I just can't find the blessed thing. I suspect I dropped it on my daily constitutional. I'd be simply scandalized if anyone saw me without it, so I shan't be going out. I absolutely must have that necklace to highlight my beauty, and that's that. Gee whiz, that must be some nice necklace, huh? Hang on... Yeah, weren't, like, the three shadows, um, playing with a necklace earlier? You know what? It's weird. I'm sure I just heard someone talking about a necklace. What's that? Do speak up! You, whoever just spoke, do you have some clue as to my necklace's whereabouts? If you do, you must help me! Please, be a dear, find it and bring it back to me. 
After that, I will most certainly join you and help my squishy little friend Punio. Don't worry, Madame Fleury. I'm sure Mario can find your necklace. Where it is? He's super. Yeah, he's Super Mario. You can do it, right, Mario? <laughs> Aw, yeah. Great, it's decided then. Let's go find it. I'm sorry to trouble you so. Okay, so let's go talk to the three shadows again. Beldum, I told you, you blamed me for losing the sketch, but you had it! Silence, you twit! Now's not the time to get hung up on stupid details. We must study this sketch! Whoa, it's the guy with a mustache. Wow, this Mario guy looks so manly. Check out that bushy mustache. How handsome. You know something though, my lovelies? I swear I've seen this gentleman before. Ah, he's Mr. Mustache! Gah, gah! Heck, I don't believe this. Vivian, this is without a doubt all your fault. No, it's not. I'll be dealing out some strict punishment later, my dearie. Oh, yes, I promise you that. <laughs> what? That's not fair. You're the one who had the... <laughs> Silence, you squirrel brain. Don't you cop that insolent attitude with me. <laughs> Ugh, this is not fair. And about that necklace, I was thinking of returning it to you, but no more! Aww. And since you caused this problem, you have to figure out how to find this Mario chump! Don't worry, we're gonna find you. Also, my cat needs to stop playing with the wire! Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Anyway, we know where we're going. I'm gonna swap to Goombella though, because I feel like this may end in a boss fight against these three, and I want scans on them. Don't need to mess with thunderclouds right now, or annoying rock monsters. Alright, hey, shadow ladies! Hey, what? <laughs> How do they always manage to do that? Get quaked. And then get burned. I love it when I can just waste the group quickly like that. That probably wasn't worth the price of that fire flower, but it was worth the time saved. Ow, what? I think this is the only attack we have that can really hit those guys, since it doesn't appear to um, affect defense. Well, that and I guess our star power move, which we do not have the star power for right now. Yes, we're still recording. Alright, hey, hey! Well, if it isn't Mario! Shiny mustache or no, you can't be too bright if you came here looking for us! Me, he, he, and you know why? Cause we were waiting for you! Ooh, that's them! They're the ones who ain't the... Wait a minute, what? You 
been waiting for Mario? What's that supposed to mean, you weirdo? <laughs> I have no quarrel with you, but I simply can't allow you to hunt for the crystal stars. And so, I'll be taking that little map of yours just as soon as I deal with you. Hey, what's your deal? How do you know about the map and the crystal stars? Have you been talking to Princess Peach, or... Wait, what am I saying? The real question is, who the heck are you? <laughs> Those who seek names are often disappointed, but if you insist, we'll tell you. We are... The Three... Shadow Sisters! The Three Shadow Sisters? Vivian, you nincompoop! What are you gambling about? It's just shadows! The three shadows! I don't know, I think Shadow Sisters has a good ring to it. Sisters makes us sound less mysterious and less scary! How many times must I remind you? Alright, sis, I'm sorry. It's just, it makes me really happy when you call me your sister, so... How insufferably sampy. Ooh, you've got some fierce punishment coming your way. Oh, gee whiz, I hate being punished. I want to give Vivian a hug. That's for later, though. First, we have to deal with this Mario and his friends. Let's do it, my lovelies. Marilyn, Vivian! The might of the three shadows, relation withheld, will be more than enough to win the day. Oh, okay. Ooh. Well, I was right about there being a fight. It's most unlucky that our sights are set on you. Well, unlucky for you, of course. Marilyn, Vivian, let's show them precisely what we can do. Ooh. Yes, sis. Alright. Information. I guess on Vivian first, because she's the one I want to know the most about. And that's Vivian. She's the youngest of the three shadows. Max HP is 10, attack is 1, and defense is 0. She doesn't seem all that noteworthy. Rude. Uh, she is kind of cute, I guess. Oh, hello. She might even be cuter than I am. Oh, does someone have a crush? I guess. Wow, I think I might be jealous. Okay, I'm sorry for having to do this to you, but I do have to do this to you. Thumbs up. All right, second one. That's Marilyn. She's one of the three shadows. Beldum's younger sister. Thanks HP is 12, attack is 2, and defense is 0. She charges up her attacks occasionally. It says here she's the toughest of the sisters, so it might be best to defeat her first, huh? Other than that, she doesn't have any particularly outstanding characteristics. Yeah. Bop! Bop! Oh, she's charged up. Attack power now boosted. And oh! Poor Mario got shrunk. Suddenly, I do have to spend another turn getting the third scan here, because, yeah. That's Beldum. She's the oldest sister, the leader of the three shadows. Max HP is 9, attack is 1, defense is 0, but her blizzard attack has an attack of 10. She can make her partners big and make us tiny, and attacks with weird magic. The worst thing about her is that snicker, sinister snicker. She sounds so totally evil. I mean, she's just the sort of person you want to avoid like the plague, you know? I think I've already experienced more than enough of that. Um, anyway... Yeah, get zapped. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Eh, you're tougher than I thought, Mr. Mustache. I guess it's time to stop toying with you. Hmm. Oh. Oh, they've got, like, fire, lightning, and ice magic. Okay. Anyway, get bonked. Yeah, I messed it up again. I think it's time for some star power, though. Damn it! And the. Not bad! And Mario got shrunk again. Cool. Anyway, you get bonked, because you're the nasty one. Now it's up to you! Alright, um... Hmm. Oh, this is awkward. I guess try Power Smashing Vivian. Ooh, get flattened. Okay, I think we want to kill the big one next. And I'm not just saying that because I like Vivian. Well, I am, but like... That's not the whole reason. No damage because Mario is still tiny. Okay, now we can genuinely attack this one. Pop, pop. Yeah, good enough. Pop, pop. Yeah. Ow. Oh, Mario's in trouble. But I think we'll be okay, so long as we get rid of this. Alright, come on. Give me a flower. Heck yeah! Bingo! Ooh, max flower power. Heck yes. Alright. Let's put that to good use, shall we? Sorry, Vivian. Ow. And you're done. Eek! Oh, the cube appears again. The effect of the charm doubled your star points. Whoa! Okay. Anyway, we definitely need more flower points. Maybe we were just a touch overconfident. Marilyn, Vivian, you lumps, we would have won if you two pulled your weight. Yeah, there's a reason I took you out first. Both of you prepare for a world-class punishment session when we get home. Ugh, but the necklace! Leave it! Sorry. 
but I do actually need this. That's Flurry's necklace. Yes, let's take it to her. Time check again. Twenty-six minutes. I think we got time to return the necklace to her, and then that's where we'll call it for today. Which unfortunately means we have to do this paper plane part again, but sometimes we do have to make sacrifices. thing. Oh, poor, poor me. When, oh, when will I see my precious necklace again? Uh, how about right now? Oh, you delightful fellow! You found my necklace! I'm beside myself, truly! But you still mustn't see me. Please, leave the necklace by the door and wait a moment. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yoink. Oh, splendid, splendid! My oh-so-ravishing necklace! I'm awash in joy! Hello? Oh, oh my word! Mario, isn't it? Are you my heroic little necklace hunter? Well, my, 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 aren't you a fine specimen of a man? Yes, indeed. You look pretty good for, like, a cloud lady. I simply must thank you for your graciousness. But how to do it? Hmm, perhaps if I grabbed you and gave you a little sugar? Uh... No thanks. Here I come, handsome. Time to give you a proper thank you. Pucker up! Once again, Mario is getting smooched by people randomly. Oh, Mario, you are just the cutest little thing I've ever laid eyes on. Yes, you are, and that's that. So tell me, are you truly looking for the crystal stars? The very same crystal stars spoken of by all the lowlifes in Rogueport? Mmm, a danger-filled search for beautiful jewels. How absolutely marvelous! And here I was thinking how frightfully bored I was. It's time for a change! And besides, I do declare that plus mustache of yours has completely swooned me. A man as manly as you must attract all sorts of trouble, and I want to keep you safe. So I dare say I'll be joining you on this little adventure. I assume that's fine, Mario? Uh, yeah. Flurry's ability is a primer. When pressing X, Flurry will exhale strong gusts of wind that can blow things away. Oh! We can use her to, like, blow away, like, little paper corners and reveal an enemy. Cool. If she blows in the direction of an enemy, she can make its head spin for a bit. Yeah, now you're all dizzy. Cool. I have mastered them. She can also squash enemies in battle with a body slam or blow them all away with gale force. She sounds very talented. 
This is wonderful! It's so nice that Fleury likes you, Mario. Really, it's great! And even more importantly, Fleury's chosen to join us! Let's go to the Great Tree! Yeah, cool. We'll go to the Great Tree tomorrow, though. For now, that's gonna be it.